uh, w you have number three, yeah? Which three in section uh, two, three we said? Uh, which three matrices E21, E31, E32 put A into the into a triangular form U? Okay, so here's what you do. This is matrix A, okay? Uh, you start with A. And uh, first, you are trying to um, make um, this here a zero. Right? So it has to be an operation E to one between uh, between row number two and row number one. So no, yeah, you just follow these, you know, these E's. So what I have to do is I would have to do uh, four negative four times row one plus row two. And what would that get me? That would get me, so we have 1, 1, 0. So I start with A, 1, 1, 0. Yeah, minus 4, exactly, minus 4 R1 plus R2. And what would you get here? You would get 0 on the first one, yeah? Uh, minus 4 plus 6 you would get 2 and here you would get 1 minus 2 to 0 right 1 1 0 okay good now this is here uh, e to 1 so what we do is we apply this e to 1 on the identity matrix So the identity matrix is uh, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1. And if we apply E to 1 here, that we applied up there, so this is the identity matrix, what do we get? Uh, minus 4 R1. So we would get minus 4 here. Mm -hmm. 1, 0, and these two stay the same. This is, this is E21. Okay, and now I take E21 times matrix A. and I multiply them so uh, let me let me copy and paste here so I can make this quicker so if I do this copy here so this is E21 and I'm gonna multiply it by matrix A which is this red one here uh, no not this 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 already changed this is no longer a uh, a is uh, 1 1 0 4 6 1 and minus 2 2 0 hold on let me open the door Okay, uh, so okay, let's use the calculator on this, yeah? Uh, because uh, uh, you know how to do matrix multiplication here. Okay, so if I put this on the calculator, I will get one second.
one one zero zero two one minus two two zero this is e21 I'm looking for e21 a times e31 so now I move on could you could you hear me yeah, I hear you. yeah so I multiplied e21 times a and I got this answer okay yeah I multiplied okay now e31 so now we go back and we do the same thing for e31 mm -hmm. so uh, we're gonna apply a row operation 31 on the result so I'm gonna take this matrix here copy I'm gonna put it here Mm -hmm. and now I need this guy to be a 0 so 3 1 so that's gonna be 2 R 1 plus R 3 and if I do that what do I get well I'm gonna get the same matrix except uh, the third row changed so I'll just copy and paste be quicker so uh, then this will be uh, 2 times 1 this will be 0 uh, this will be 2 plus 2 4 and then 0 plus 0 is 0 so I get this okay okay now uh, how do I get so now I apply e31 on the identity matrix uh, what's the identity the uh, let me let me copy and paste the identity matrix here so I don't have to rewrite it so and with that same row operation uh, e31 will equal uh, so if I do uh, I'm gonna apply this on on this matrix on the identity matrix mm -hmm. uh, 2 R 1 plus R so 2 times 1 is 2 plus 0 so this becomes 2 when I apply 2 R 1 plus R 3 on this this will stay 0 and this will stay 1 so this is my e3 1 so now I'm gonna find out e3 1 so I start to reverse, yeah, from A backwards, times E21 times A. So that's the next step. Now E21 times A, I already have that. Uh, this is E21 times A here. So let me put this here. Uh, Yeah. Uh, this is e to one times a. This is e to one times a, and I'm gonna multiply this by. Uh, why did this shift? By e three one. E three one is one zero zero. Let me just write it quick. Zero one zero two zero one. And you do this on the calculator, and you get e two one a this will be one second oh e three one has to come before i i reverse them here uh, sorry about that this guy uh, this you get my idea this guy has to be here and this guy has to be here okay so just flip the uh, uh, because because this here is e 
2 1 times a right e to 1 times a is 1 1 0 yeah this has this is e to 1 a and this here is e 3 1 so they have to be flipped so anyways when you flip them you get uh, 1 1 0 let me change the color here 1 1 0 uh, 0 2 1 and 0 4 0 so this is e3 1 e2 1 a okay so we are up to this point now we still need e3 2 okay so e3 2 uh, what's e3 2 I'm gonna take a negative 2 oops uh, negative 2 times r2 plus r3 why because I need to make this guy a 0 so now we will do minus 2 r2 uh, this should go on, on row number 3 minus 2 r2 plus r3 okay okay so now apply this on the identity matrix so the identity matrix is uh, 1 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 1 and let me just change it here so if I do minus 2 row 2 minus 2 times 0 plus 0 is 0 this stays 0 uh, minus 2 times 1 will be minus 2 plus 0 this one will be minus 2 mm -hmm. and minus 2 times 0 is 0 plus 1 this will remain 1 so this is my e 3 2 what happens on the identity the result of what happens on the identity matrix is your elimination matrix okay and now finally I get my e 3 2 times e 3 1 times e 2 1 times a e 3 2 is right here this guy let's just put it here copy paste right this is my e3 2 e3 2 and then my e3 1 e2 1 a I already have it uh, sorry this is 3 1 it's this right so now this goes here and we multiply them uh, and let's do that on the calculator and finally we get our u which is e32 e31 e21 times a u is all this all right uh, equal C one one zero zero two one zero zero minus two which is the upper triangular matrix okay So uh, this answers what u is, and now uh, which three matrices put a into the triangular form u? Um, okay, we did that. So uh, so now what's matrix M? Matrix M is e three two times e three one times e two one. So we got every single one of them. 
so matrix M would be E32 times E31 times E21 and you just multiply them we have all of them we got all of them in the process yeah what was done to the identity matrix through row operation is M and so if we multiply them out we get let me let me calculate them here really quick mm -hmm. we get one zero zero minus four one zero ten minus two one so uh, e21 e31 and e32 are the elementary matrices that you were asking me about e31 uh, and e21 and e32 those are the matrices that turn your matrix into an upper triangular matrix mm?